All right, so back again for Tech Vitamins. This is uh, Ted. And Mate. And uh, today we're going to be uh, running you through a little tutorial showing you how to update your radio for the HTC Thunderbolt from Verizon Wireless. Uh, update your radio from uh, MR 2.0 to MR 2.5. So, and it's already running the uh, Sanjay Mod Canon Release 7 on there, uh, version 1.3. Um, and we're going to be upgrading to 1.4 and doing a full review of the Sanjay Mod ROM on this phone in a few days. So if you got any questions, post them right now before we do the full review. But let's let's get to it. All right. So before we uh, did all this, we downloaded the radio update, which we've got on the uh, server, and we'll post the link uh, below the video. And uh, all you've got to do is just rename that image or rename that uh, radio to PG05IMG.zip if it, if it already isn't renamed that. And uh, you'll put that on the root of your SD card and then you'll boot into HBoot. Well, actually, before you do that, just show them the file if you want. If I, cause I had it. Let's go to. There it is, PG05, IMG.zip. But you can't think I have it, I have it. Oh, we got it. I still put it down. It went yeah. All right, so first we're going to uh, go ahead and power off the phone. All right, and then holding volume down and then power we're going to boot into H boot and the phone automatically recognizes that there is a radio update and then you'll get this little confirmation here it says volume up for yes volume down for no we're going to go ahead and uh, push volume up for yes because we do want to update and then we'll just go ahead and let it do its thing There you go, you notice a little meat on the top right with the loading bar. So we're about halfway done. But of that step. Yeah, actually there's a few steps. But definitely stay tuned for the full review, man. This the Sanja Mod ROM update has done a lot of great things for this phone. And I'll be explaining all of that in the review. So And one thing you really want to look out is uh, make sure you do have at least 30% of battery because if uh, something goes wrong in this process, it uh, more than likely will result in a brick. There you go. Speaking of the battery, I did actually recently upgrade to the big boy, the city of 3200 milliamp battery. And, um, yeah, we don't really have a real view on that yet. I'll probably post it up, but it's definitely a lot of improvement, especially when we're riding on 4G. Because we're wedged right in between Baltimore and DC, and uh, luckily, we pretty much got 4G everywhere in between, which is great. So we don't have to be going into the city just to use 4G, but it drains a lot of battery power, a lot. Okay, now we can um, reboot. It's ready to go, so I'm telling you to press power. Let's go ahead and do that. There we go. And that's pretty much it. As long as we get the little um, cyanogen guy on the screen, we're good to go. We didn't break it. Well, actually. Still an HTC screen, so let's not get too happy. There, there we go. There he is. <laughs> Skating around. We're good to go. <laughs> Alright, so yeah, now you guys don't have anything to worry about, you know. It's uh, not too hard to go ahead and flash the radio. But uh, like I said, just uh, remember that you do have it, uh, had the phone powered up or, or plugged in. And uh, 
If you have any questions, leave those down below. And uh, we also have the link for the uh, radio down below if you didn't hear that. Yep, and it's going to be down below. I'm just going to say it in case you can't read. It's uh, tech-vitamins.com slash android slash radios. And it's all lowercase. And give us some comments. Thanks, guys.